they would give the shirt off their back to anybody. Jason Hodgson thinking back on his two brothers, Elmer and Kojak. They're awesome people. I mean, I don't think you can find anybody to say a bad word about them. Kojak died last year after a long battle with substance abuse. He fought a drug addiction most of his life, and he, you know, he tried hard to get off it and couldn't. Elmer also had a drug problem, though he died of cancer a few years earlier. Now Hodgson brothers Salvage Yard and the whole trucking community are raising awareness for addiction. <laughs> Over 100 trucks drove into Swanton Saturday from across our region, even from Canada, for a parade through town. Be aware of, you know, of uh, the issues and everything on the streets. And I think this right here is a big opportunity to show people that we actually care. Along with raising awareness, they're raising money for the task force to reduce substance abuse. With every event like this, whether it's in Swanton or another community, is that individuals that need help will feel that they have a community of support. For the Hodgden family, it's all they can do to keep their loved one's memories alive and prevent it from happening to anyone else. It's a big problem, and we're not gonna make even the smallest dent in it, but to know that we might be able to help one person or bring awareness to one person. I would like somebody to see this and step up and say they need help and go get help.